hi guys welcome back to another video so as you saw today's title of the video y'all gonna be spending the weekend with me i don't have work this weekend honestly my arms are a little sore i did some stretches yesterday right now this is i'm getting ready i'm not doing my makeup but i'm gonna be getting ready i'm getting ready to go to the grocery store it's one that's right by my house so i'm gonna walk there I gotta get some marshmallows. I gotta get some more pets. And I might buy me some, some takis. Y'all, my desk is a mess, so I'm gonna have to clean that this weekend. My room is clean, but my desk and my, my rolling cart is a mess. So I gotta fix that up. I'm forgetting I bought this Chi helmet spray. I gotta wash my wigs also, so it's gonna be a packed weekend, y'all. Okay, the shirt is from Pretty Little Thing. My jeans are from Sheen. These leg warmers are from Just Style. I'm telling y'all, it's cold. I can tell. I went in that bathroom. I was freezing. So, yeah, what I need from the grocery store? Marshmallows. So, wipes like these ones. Whichever ones, like saw Crocs, whatever. Whatever's cheapest. If not, I'll just go to the dollar store tomorrow. Cause yeah. I like this. I used them all when I was cleaning my room. So that's why I didn't get to my desk. That's what I'm like, I need to wipe off my desk. Put all my makeup where it belong. I really wanna do a video where I organize all my makeup and like look through everything. But I don't know. I don't know. Now it's time to put on the wig. These braids are a month old. I'm taking them out this weekend. <laughs> All right, y'all. I made it back home. Oh, and it's filled to the brown. This this is my favorite juice, cran raspberry. What? Tigies. I, when I left out the house, I'm like, oh snap, I need to get a bag because ain't no way. Got the pad. Marshmallows. Clorox wipes. I have this big old box right here. So I ordered this from Urban Outfitters like two days ago. And I didn't pay for fast shipping either. I paid for regular shipping. And it came very fast. It's not cold, so maybe they just really wanted to get rid of it. The only reason why I bought it was because it was on sale. Oh, this is way bigger than, I mean, I knew the box was big, but dang, sale. So I was like, okay, it was only $25 and it usually costs $75. So I was like, let me get So I want my um bulletin board to go up here, but I have this Hello Kitty Follow Your Dreams display. And like, I do not want to move it. Like I could easily move it to this wall because you know it fits and the bulletin board doesn't fit over there but oh my gosh like the symbolism behind it i put up my pink um juicy couture bulletin board i'm over here drinking this little knockoff arizona i really wanted the arizona but they ain't have it so but we just got a package <laughs> i got a package um i ordered this I know the lighting is very bad because I'm just sitting in the dark in my room. I'm chilling. Okay, I'm relaxing. I ordered a phone case because look at my old phone case. Look at it. It's supposed to be pink. This is the color it's supposed to be. Look at it. Uh, well over there. And like it had this little part right here where it had a strap. But 
took it off and it broke so so i ordered this phone case from velvet caviar oh it got a little dust bag it better for 20 dollars i don't know why i spent 20 dollars on this y'all like what is wrong with me what is wrong with me i spent 20 dollars on this 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 little phone charm and it's cute don't get me wrong it's cute but i bu i just bought a juicy couture one for five dollars from um urban outfitters so if y'all want the the juicy couture one go to urban outfitters i feel like it's gonna be the last like that's their last time selling it because it's on sale oh this is the phone case i got pink of course pink is my favorite color it says it's pretty and protective it feels very good this is so cute this is literally the powerpuff girls type case like i think this is Y'all, the way they had me build this is so fucking stupid. Like, I already broke two pieces of wood. Here go one of them. Broke this piece. JD. That's what it's called. JD. I broke it. Alright, so this part. He putting in the JD piece. Look, he really struggled. He really struggled. He can only fit one side in, the other side rests on the floor. He's struggling, this side ready to fall down, rest on the floor. Mind you, this is like step five. That's literally step four. Four, five. He's struggling to put it in, look. He scraped it against the side, the inside of that part is white scrape mark i got a scrape mark on mine and mine wasn't sitting snugly underneath the silver thing it was a gap between that and the silver thing you see it just fell so y'all see him struggling with it if the man that's putting it, putting it together for the video struggling with it then obviously people at their house gonna struggle with it all right boom go to the comments are those little skinny wood pieces needed only asking because i broke one I just broke both. I broke both of them. Both of them broke in half. Because doing this part at this side, like doing this step at this part of the built-in process, don't make no fucking sense. What really should happen was, if we're gonna put it in at this part, we should have never put one of these on the side. We sh we should put one on this side, put the thing in, put the JDs in, and the silver parts in let them rest on the floor then we put this one in because you gotta um screw the screws into the bottom piece of the wood right there put this one in and then we could slide up the jds into the holes that's on the inside of this that's what makes sense but the way they got it don't make no sense at all so boom let's get back to the part i'm, I'm at right now you said 22 after you put all these nails in This part right here. Stop. Stop 10. Screws. Put the screws in there. Why Why are you just now putting the screws in there? You should put the screws in there when you put the pieces of wood in there. The little pieces of wood in there. This don't make no sense. Okay, as you guys can see, the dresser is built. I messed up. This part and the wood part, you shouldn't be able to see it. It should be on the other side, but I can't change it because I screwed, I hit all the nails in, and in the way, I'm ready to take it all out, so. 
for real, for real. I can just paint over that for real. But yeah, finally done. I'm gonna put my clothes in them. I'm happy. Also, I could put up my lamp. Hold on. So I'm gonna put up my lamp. Stuff on here now. Tissues. I don't like the color, so I want to paint over this as well. Make it pink. I got pink, it's just not with me right now. So that's what I plan on doing. I want to do that before I will put it in. So that's what right here is now I can start putting my clothes in here. I'm heavy about this. Crushing vanity. It's $50 though. But it's cute. But it's too small for me. Okay, y'all. I had work today. I went to work and now I'm like, I want to show y'all my haul. So, first, I went to Ulta and I got these good molecules things I saw was good for like hyperpigmentation. Okay, the reason why I bought this is because I have hyperpigmentation on my feet from eczema so i used to have eczema on my feet like on like the flat part of the foot and like the ankle a little bit going up to like i can't even show y'all i'm not going to take a picture of it right now but i'm gonna show y'all a picture of the foot from out in our market from where i had eczema and where i had it the eczema is gone there it's no eczema but it's just this color it's like darker than the rest of my body and usually, you know, your feet are usually lighter than the rest of your body because they never go out in the sun. Unless you, you know, unless you're outside all the time with your feet out. But your feet is usually lighter than the rest of your body when you don't go out in the sun. So, like, when people go to the beach or to the pool, you can tell, like, oh, they feet lighter than the rest of your body because your feet is always in your shoes and always in socks. Not exposed to the sun. But for me, it's dark. I also have eczema on my finger like right here you can see this color is darker also it's a little scaly i have a little bit right here like it's darker this right here is the eczema it's just discoloration period i had something on my arm like right here i don't i'm not sure if it's still there so i bought good molecules so i bought it says i have three steps cleanse discoloration body treatment and SPF. so i've been seeing the serum which is this one no this one i've been seeing the serum go all around tiktok i always see an ad for it and people say oh i love it i love it then i have this toner this toner is a nyan's okay i don't know how to say it but it's a brightening toner I bought everything that's brightening. And then I bought the discoloration body treatment. So this is supposed to help with the appearance of dark marks and discoloration. What I got from Ulta. I went to TJ Maxx. I got some exfoliating gloves. Pink, of course. This was $3.99. I think everything I got was $3.99. Then I got this pack of white ones. It's, it's just two pairs, so four. And this was $3.99 as well. And then I bought these nail files, these glass nail files. They're way better for the environment. And I only I'm only down to one nail file. Like I plan on doing my nails this weekend. Like once you use these, you could just rinse them off. I also got this cuticle pusher and like picker remover. $3.99 as well. I saw it and I was like, yeah, I gotta get it. Cause I really I need one. The last thing I got was this acetone 
because the acetone I got right now, it fell and it spilled, so it's only like this much left, and I didn't use any of it. I, also, also was selling the oil I needed, but they selling it for ten ninety nine, and I'm like, I'm not buying it for ten ninety nine when it's it costs nine ninety nine on the website. Like y'all, I was texting. Yeah, so I just realized also gave me the wrong serum, and I used it, but fuck it. I'm gonna put, I'm, I'm gonna bring it. I'm like, somebody, hold on, let me just check. I felt like, I knew I should have checked when I was in the store. Damn. I knew I should have checked when I was in the store. But, I'm like, hold on, this, this don't say nothing about this coloration. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. But I checked my orders and it's supposed to have like the orange package and like the toner. Gel X and of course I didn't record it. I swear my best work. Well, I hate when I hate how this one not dangling. Like why you not dangling? Well, whatever this one is. But I hate how my best work is always when I don't record. Like ah, look at it, y'all, look at it. These parts right here, it's like parts of these cherries. Cause I don't have any rhinestones, so I had to use my nail clippers to cut up the gems on these cherries. It's so cute. Look at this pink set. I actually got inspired by this Instagram pic. I'm going to put it right here. And literally, the only thing that inspired me was pink. And I saw that we had the same charm. I'm like, oh yeah, let me get these. I got all my charms is from Shein. And this chain is actually from a bracelet. But I don't wear bracelets. So, I was like, always see the um the korean gel nails channels that do like asmr nails i always see them do the chain the chain is a bit bigger than i want it to be because you know it's from a bracelet but like they use the smaller chains made for like charms but y'all it's so cute most of my nails on this hand are crooked but i don't care like it look good like <laughs> Alright, I think this is gonna gonna be the end of the vlog. So if you guys like this collective vlog, give it a thumbs up or subscribe down below for more. Um I know it's a bunch of stuff and different things. But if you want another one, y'all probably get another one like next month. Yeah. Around next month. Cause um I'm about to have some wig videos out i know i'm gonna have two wig videos out not back to back i don't know what i'm gonna put in between them but yeah i'm gonna have two wig videos out for y'all